Hey you guys, it's Sweat Trainer Kelsey Wells. I'm here with Women's Health today and we are going to be doing a glutes and hamstrings circuit. This is from my new Power at Home program and it's a perfect workout to do at home. All we're gonna need are some dumbbells. So we're going to be doing three exercises, 10 reps of each and then rest 30 seconds and then repeat that for 10 minutes. Okay you guys, let's get started. First. We are going to just be using one dumbbell for our goblet squats. You want to stand holding it right here in front of your chest, with both hands upright. And then we squat back and squeeze at the top. Push back with your hips. Make sure that your knees are tracking in line with your toes. 10 reps here, so that's three, four. Keeping our chest upright, our core nice and strong. Seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, the second exercise, we're gonna grab our other dumbbell. For the reverse lunge, you can either hold them at your side or hold them up here, whatever's more comfortable. And we're going to lunge back and alternate. And this is ten per side. Keeping our core nice and strong. Halfway through. Using your breath. Nine. Ten. All right, our third exercise. We won't be using our dumbbells for this one. Set those aside. All right, and then we have our glute bridges. So we're down on the ground for this one. We have our palms facing down, gently pressing into the floor. And all you're going to do is lift with your hips straight into the air. When you're at the top of your bridge, you want your knees and ankles to be almost stacked. And then down. Lift and squeeze at the top and down. 10 reps of this as well. That's five. Keeping our core strong. Two more. Nine. And 10. And now, 30 second rest. Okay, you guys, our first 30 second rest is up. It's time to get back into our circuit, starting at the top with our goblet squat. So I have my one dumbbell. I'm gonna hold it in a sumo squat position. And we're squatting back with our chest nice and proud. Pushing our hips back, making sure our knees are tracking in line with our toes. That's halfway. Squeeze at the top. Nine and 10. All right, grabbing my other dumbbell. Going straight into our reverse lunges. Dumbbells up here, or again, you can hold them down here if it's more comfortable for you. 10 reps per side, 20 reps total. Don't forget to use your breath. Seven, eight, keeping our core strong. 10, we're halfway there. All right, last exercise in our tricep circuit is those glute bridges. We're here on the floor, palms facing down, gently resting on the floor. We have our feet shoulder width apart, and we're going to lift and squeeze at the top. 10 reps. Nine. Six. 
six. Bring your core tight, lift through the hips, seven, eight. One more, 10. And we have another 30 second rest. Okay, you guys, our 30 second rest is over. It's time to smash out the circuit one more time. We can do it once more full out in the 10 minutes. So I'm gonna grab just one of our dumbbells straight into our goblet squats. 10 more reps. Pushing our hips back, keeping our chest tall. Making sure your knees are in line with your toes. One more. All right, reverse lunges. Grabbing our second dumbbell, coming to the top of your mat, starting with your feet shoulder width apart, holding the dumbbells here or up here. This time I'm gonna hold them here for us. Reverse and alternate. 20 reps total, 10 reps each side. That's 10, we're halfway. <sighs> One more. Okay, last exercise of our last and final round our glute bridges. So we're back down on the ground. We're wanting our feet to be shoulder width apart. Palms facing down on the floor. Lifting, you know the form by now. Our palms are facing down. Our core is strong, our feet are shoulder width apart. Squeezing at the top. That's halfway. Nine. One more, and 10. That is our at-home dumbbell-only glutes and hamstrings 10-minute workout. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you're a little bit sweaty like I am. Thanks for joining me.